Hey guys, it's Nico, and today I'll be giving you guys weekly update number 19 on the fan channel. And today I have a very special guest. Um, he's a really good friend of mine. He makes great mocks that I'd say are either equal and somewhat better than mine. Um, say, um, I have Chris Production Studios here. Say hi, dude. Yeah, guys, um, I just did Mini Update 9, which isn't really a mini update, according to some people, because it's over five minutes, but I don't really care. That's why I call it. I'm going to have one more of those on the main channel, and then all the only updates you'll see are updates um, from this channel, unless the updates are like immediate updates on like contests or something like that. Um, but yeah, this update is going to be quick. I'm going to try to make it quick. Um, but um, what I what I've been do but this is just basically showing what me and Frosty did before he left. Frosty is Jordan, the um, the guy who was there with me um, during the last video on on the main channel. Um, and as you can see here, I have the fans' choice mock. Um, I'd say like 35% of this was done like by me for like the last an hour to like for the last two hours hour 30 minutes maybe because frosty left like a, a long time ago it's like oh yeah he left like two hours ago yeah so i've been working like 35 percent of this has just been all me for the past uh two hours and then you know <sighs> planet killer mock is is gone but hey it's all good um the good news i managed to get in touch with fluffy dog customs or tommy and I will be getting another jet um, being sent along with my uh, new um, my new art trooper for this month, which is my review. Um, and Lego Dude 3707 and Lego Boy 12312 still send your guys' jets. I still want to do the comparison on those. I, um, however, I'm not sure. I think I might make you guys um, both into Sonic Troopers right after the review, but um, still send them anyway. Um, because I would really like to review your guys' uh, customs and stuff. Um, and, uh, basically, um, if you guys are wondering why this whole base plate is not covered with anything, it's because that's going to be the focus point of my mock, and it's, I'm still debating whether or not it's going to be a temple that's going to stand for Yavin 4, or if it's going to stand for something else, like a fountain or something, like, and that's if it's going to be Rhodia. Very epic, uh, hill right there. Um, and that one was made by me. A few of these dirt mounds were made by Frosty and all the, um, plants and stuff that was made by him as well. Um, but, uh, yeah, that's going to be the focus point. Um, the vote is tied right now. This is the first time ever that I've had um, a fans choice mock or fans choice mock options both tied, um, two of them tied, like the day before the mock uh, the mock contest closed. However, I think Chris is probably going to vote today. Is that right? Yeah. So we'll see what he votes on. Um, I mean, if you guys vote for Yavin Four. I like. I would really like that because I would like to make a temple mock. I have. Well, I'm, I would like to make the temple design. I've been really um, wanting to do that for some time. And um, but if you guys vote for Rodia or anything else, I mean, I'm not saying Korriban or some other mock will get like 15 votes in one night. But you know, because I'm not like David, where I get a comment like every on a video of, like every uh, few uh, few minutes. But um, yeah. So, I mean, that's just pretty much it. Um, cleaned up most of this. I'm going to, you know, take out the brown pieces from there. There's all of my droids in here. My supers, I'm just reorganizing them. I'm leaving these four corporate alliance tanks out because I'm planning to use that in that mock. Whether if it is Rhodia or Yavin 4, I'm still going to use those corporates and use those spider droids. Also, guys, I am getting one of the Aerial Light printed helmets, and that in particular is the um, oh Pre Vistla helmet. I am going to be getting that for my Pre Vistla, and I will review it. 
That'll be my first review of an area light custom. Also, I will be reviewing, um, hopefully, CAC Commando Droids. I'm going to probably ask my mom to, um, you know, buy the Commando Droids from the site because I have the droid arms and the legs already, as you guys have seen. Um, I am also going to probably be getting a few Geonosians, or I'm going to try to from a friend of mine. Old Geonosians, by the way, not the new ones. Because honestly, I think the older ones are cooler than the new ones. That's just person. That's just my opinion. I mean, I've seen the reviews on them, but in my personal opinion, guys, the older ones are cooler. Even though the newer ones are a lot more accurate to the Clone Wars, I say, um, you know, the older ones look a lot cooler, and just in my opinion, you know. I mean, I know Oscar Mel will totally dog me for that, but, you know, hey, it's what I think. Um, so, yeah, I mean, that's just pretty much it. And what else I've, I've been up to, you know, nothing much. I mean, all of the building and stuff that's just come today, I mean, and my Lego order, I ordered two more battle packs, so now I have, like, 35 of the new battle packs. I don't know how many David has, but I'll get in touch with him about that later. So, yeah, um, Horn Company is complete of 40 troops. So now I have exactly 1,157 clones. That's exact, and I know that number off the top of my head. Um, so, yeah, I apologize if the mock is dark in some areas, like in this corner right here and then in this corner right here if it's dark. But, um, yeah, guys, I will be getting a new camera soon. So, um, yeah, uh, Chris, anything you'd like to say before we go? Um, just subscribe, guys, and subscribe to me and Nico here, and watch my new Clone Army Custom Shapeway review. Uh, yeah, he has a new Clone Army Custom order. Um, I'll try to see if I can get that link in the video. <laughs> I'm not sure if I can, but I'll try. Um, but yeah, this is the uh, Yavin 4 slash Rhodia mock. I mean, like I said, I don't think I'm gonna get, um, I don't think I'm gonna get like, uh, you know, like a co like a bunch of uh, comments for another mock in one night, like 15 mock, uh, 15 votes for Korriban in one night. You know, I haven't had that happen before, but hey, if it happens, it happens. You know, I'll just leave this up for something else, or I just might do Yavin 4 or something anyway. Um, and also, Bman610, if you're watching this, yeah, I got the flower idea from you. I got these pieces when I was at the Glendale Lego store. Oh, and I got really mad at my mom because, like, they're out of town, like I said, and so it was just me and Frosty, and then, you know, I have my grandparents and my aunt here with me, you know, just to keep me company. But, um, and, you know, watch me, I guess. But, um, yeah, it turns out there was a Lego store near where my parents were going with my two little brothers and my mom sent me a picture of it i got so mad because i had no idea there was going to be a lego they were going to head to a lego store if they were i would have gotten a ton more two by four bricks just for the temple if you guys would have voted on yavin 4 but at the same time i wouldn't have had a great time with my friend frosty oh god this update is almost as long as the last one <laughs> but um yeah so uh you know um I guess that's pretty much it. I mean, I'll have the uh, Advanced Choice Mock results uh, video tomorrow. And uh, yeah, just go sub to Chris, go sub to me. I'll have the link to his channel in the description. And bye.